Guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install Android 4.4 KitKat on your Nexus 4. You can see here my device is running Android 4.3 Jelly Bean now. So, my bootloader is in currently locked state. So, in this video, I'll show you how to unlock your bootloader and how to install Android 4.4 KitKat on your Nexus 4 device. So, for this, you need to install Android SDK in the USB drivers and you need to download Fastboot. And you need to extract the passport to your Android SDK folder. So I'll just show you guys under C. So here is my SDK. So you're under the platform tools. So here is my ADB and passport. So if you don't know how to install the Android SDK and how to install the USB drivers, I'll leave the guide. I'll leave the link to the guide in the description. So I'll leave all the download links in the description down below. So for this, all you need to do is need to unlock your bootloader first so go to settings go to about phone tap on build number until you see you are now a developer so i have already done that go to developer options check on usb debugging you can see here so after that go to your sdk under platform tools so you can copy the command prompt here or you can press shift and right click so you can see here open command prompt window here after that type in adb devices so you can see here list of devices attached so you need to see something like this so that means your drivers are currently installed correctly so after that connect your device to your pc type in adb reboot bootloader then press enter now your Nexus 4 will reboot into bootloader state so now you need you can see here lock state so my bootloader is currently locked so if you want to unlock your bootloader make sure back up your device because this is going to wipe your device after that type in so type in fast boot oem unlock then press enter so it will ask you here on your device if you want to unlock your bootloader so use your power button so use your volume up button and then use your power button to confirm so it's erasing your device now So currently you are just unlocking your bootloader so, so you can see now your bootloader is unlocked box state is showing unlocked so now download the factory image of android 4.4 kitkat so i will leave the download link in the description so after you download the factory image you can see here I downloaded my factory image somewhere. So you can see here. So right click on it, 7 zip. So click on extract here. So you can see the file has been extracted here. So it's, it's not going to take a lot of time. So right click on that, 7 zip extract files so press ok it's going to create a folder here so go to that folder just to make it simple copy all the files and then copy them to go to your SDK platform tools and copy them here you can see I already copied it copied the whole files here so after that go to your command prompt and type in flash so you can see the bat file here flash all flash hyphen all dot pat then so make sure guys make sure that you type correctly flash all dot bat then press enter 
so you can see now it's going to flash Android 4.4 KitKat on your Android device. You can see it's writing. So you don't know we don't need to do anything, it's going to do that on its own. So wait patiently guys because it's going to take some time so be patient. You can see it's writing to the device now. Not downloading, writing user data. So, finished now. Press exit. You can see the bootloader is unlocked now. So, now you're going to see Android 4.4 Kit on your device. So it's a lot easier than you think guys just go on and read the tutorials then come back so you need to install the SDK and you need to install the USB drivers if you don't install the USB drivers correctly you're going to get an error message saying like waiting for device or device not detected like something like this so first make sure you install your USB drivers correctly and then come to this tutorial so and one more thing is if you are unlocking your bootloader make sure you back up all your data first so this is the method that you are going to wipe all your data and you are going to flash a factory image straight into your Nexus 4 so there is another way where you can save all your data and you can just update to Android 4.4 so if you guys want to know how to do that just leave it to comment down below guys because I don't want to make that video but if you, you people are interested I'll show you how to do that without wiping your phone so in this video I made a complete reset guys so it wiped all my data on my phone and it's just installed the factory image of Nexus 4 Android 4.4 so that is boot animation of Android 4.4 on my Nexus 4 So my next video will be going on how to root your Android for the Android. Sorry, guys. Uh, my next video is going to be how to root your Nexus 4 running Android 4.4 through ADB. So make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to my channel, guys. Please show your support. Leave your feedback down below. If you, I'm always trying to improve my videos. So these are my initial stages. So just show your support by hitting the like button. And leave your feedback down below in the comment section and if you had any doubts leave in the com leave a comment down below and I'll be always there to help you so there is the welcome screen so I'm going to skip this for now finish and you can see Android 4.4 KitKat on your Nexus 4 so go to just to show you guys go to settings about phone you can see here android version 4.4 kitkat
there it is so hit the like button and subscribe to my channel guys that's it for now it's goodbye